whenever you are calculating something and your calculation as time progresses or as you move deeper into an assignment your calculation may add a lot of worksheets to your workbook and uh, you may have a lot of links in your entire workbook many a times to quickly understand what is happening and how the calculations are connected you need to walk through the numbers very quickly you can use the arrows for your understanding so let's say if you are here and you want to find out where are these numbers coming from the arrows are in formulas and trace precedents and now you can note that i have got a link to where the numbers are coming from these are blue arrows they turn red when there is an error in one of these so for example if there is an error in one of these you can note that the arrow turns red i am undoing the error so the shortcut for this will be alt m and p and now you can note that i have got arrows to the precedent cells if i want to find out where this number is coming from i am again using alt m p and you can note that i have got these numbers from here alt m p and it keeps on pointing me to the last precedent cells alt m p and now you can note that it will guide me even to the original cells and like that i can trace the source or origination of a particular calculation i can also check whether there are any cells dependent on the cell so that points me to the next dependent cell so alt m d will quickly drive me and point me to the next dependent cells you can note that there are some cells on other sheets which are dependent on this cell so accordingly alt m p and alt m d are the shortcuts for tracing precedents and tracing dependents to remove all the arrows you need to press alt m a a which is for removing all the arrows so these are the shortcuts which are very useful for tracing and auditing whenever you are checking the models or calculations